In response to the Fortitude budget, MPs focus their attention on the social aspects of fighting the pandemic. Some made calls to introduce COVID-19 related childcare leave, as well as more support for the arts, sports, the sports industry, as well as persons with disabilities. MP Denise Poir says that this group must not be left behind in efforts to digitalize and create those job opportunities. So this battle against the, our common enemy, COVID-19, can only be truly won if we include those whom some in our society perceive as the lost, the least, and the last amongst us. Let us not give up easily on those who are willing to change, but not able to change for some reasons. Whether they are SMEs, social service agencies, our elderly, our disabled, or others who are vulnerable in our Singapore family. They say it takes a globe to fight this pandemic. And indeed, the globe includes us, and it starts with each one of us. Separately, Workers' Party Chief Pritam Singh said that politics will take a back seat for a unity of purpose in times of the COVID-19 crisis. Now, that's to enable Singapore to single-mindedly overcome the challenge. But he says that there still needs to be accountability on how the government is dealing with the crisis. Singaporeans have a right to expect a thorough review and accounting on the response to this public health crisis. Some both in and out of this house, have suggested a commission of inquiry or some other independent body to review specific aspects of the government's response thus far.